token is an entity including security credentials of a FLASP user and a set of privileges assigned to him. Creating a FLASP token is an essential part when working with FLASP REST API and MQTT. The process is intuitive yet flexible. To create a token, open the FLASP panel at flasp.io, navigate to the Tokens menu item and click the plus sign. Here, you give token a name, set an expiration date or the time to live value, and most importantly, specify the access permissions. You can choose to create a standard token, it won't have access to the FLASP platform API, only to the modules APIs. A master token that gives full access to the entire FLASP platform. Or set specific access control lists to fine-tune permissions. Let's have a look at the ACL options. When you open the ACL drop-down, you can choose a specific FLASP module or object type you want to customize access to. Then, you can narrow down the list of HTTP methods that the user can apply and also specify the IDs of individual objects, in this case channels, that the user can access. For the MQTT module, The settings are different. Here you can set the topics allowed for access, the possible actions, publish, subscribe or both, and also the list of HTTP methods. As you can see, you can have several ACLs created for a single token. Once everything is set, click the Save button to create a token. Note a handy Copy button to easily copy the token to the clipboard and later paste it where it belongs.